everyone, welcome to my channel, 10 Ways to Wear It, your home for relatable, wearable, and affordable fashion. I'm Alicia, and in today's video, we are going to be dressing up jeans. If you are a jean girl like me, and you feel most comfortable when you're wearing jeans, this is the video for you. I'm gonna be taking six different styles of jeans and dressing them up all different types of ways. So each pair, I'm gonna style multiple ways. So if you need some ideas on how to jazz up your jean looks, if you have some events coming up, if you just wanna look cute when you go out, girl, I got you on today's video let's go ahead and get into it because these looks are fire Okay, so jumping right into the video, like I said, I'm gonna be styling up six different styles of jeans, and the first is gonna be my favorite style of jean, and if you've been following me for a while, you should know what I'm about to say. I'm gonna be styling up Levi 501 Originals. Yes, I love Levi 501s. I have taper ones, I have straight legs, I have mid-wash, dark wash, I have cropped, I have full length. I have pretty much every style of Levi 501s because they just happen to work for my body, and they are my favorite style of jeans. So this is the pair I'm gonna be styling up. It's, they're slightly distressed. They have a little bit of, you know, washout in the middle here, distressed on the pockets a little bit. Very simple pair of jeans, but like I said, one of my faves. So let's style these up, not one, not two, but three different ways. Alrighty, here is the first look featuring my Levi 501s. And my jeans are cuffed. I just prefer them that way, especially when I'm trying to like showcase my shoes and whatnot. I like to just cuff them, but you definitely don't have to do that if you don't want to. But what I basically have on is a rhinestone bustier. Really, really pretty. This is from Amazon. As you can see, it has tons of sparkle and pizzazz. I threw it on with this cropped blazer from Boohoo. Thought that would be a nice finish on top of it. And then I threw on these little rhinestone sling bags from Shein because they kind of tie in with the bustier and a simple little vintage bag and yes honey this is like the look I had to kick y'all off right and you know styling up my favorite jeans with this really cute going out outfit this is ideal for girls night out birthdays you know anything where you just want to shine literally and figuratively this is the look and I'll link all of these pieces you can always get the extenders for the back of this if it's like too small they do sell the five hook extenders because this bralette does have five hooks or this bustier so i'll link that as well for you guys but yes first look definitely a vibe definitely a look that i'm rocking i love it Alrighty, folks here is the next look featuring my levi 501s and i love this look i don't know if it's ideal for summer like I've told you guys in past videos, I pretty much dress the same all year long, so I just kind of deal with the heat and just swallow it and take it and deal with it. But this is definitely a look that I would still rock, um, especially if I'm gonna be indoors under an air conditioner, like at a restaurant or something. I think this is such a cute little going out look. And what I basically have on is a simple short sleeve white shirt, that's from Shein, with the Levi's of course. Threw on a black boucle trimmed vest. This is from Shein. It's a cute little double-breasted vest. It runs a little long, runs a little big. If you're gonna order it, I will link it. And then I just threw on my studded Amazon to drop heels and a nice little simple bag. And this look, very classic, simple, upscale. Like I said, you can wear this for anything from a date night, girls night out, whatever. It's a nice, classic, upscale look, but it's still kind of fun and cute because you got on those distressed jeans with the look so yeah that's the second one let's get into one more alrighty folks here is my last dressed up look featuring my Levi 501 jeans and this is such a feel-good outfit I'm wearing the 501s with this puffy sleeve sort of ruched top this is from Amazon the drop it's from Tanika B's drop collection and I paired it with these really cute like lace up sandals those are from Shein. they're the same color as the blouse and i threw in some gold accessories you can see i have on a gold belt and i threw in a gold bag and some gold jewelry so yeah this look is just so cute like i said a feel good outfit when i wear yellow i always feel like i'm just spreading good vibes and yeah definitely summer vibes very lightweight top nice little gold accessories to kind of pop against the outfit and yes honey I am feeling this and of course I'm feeling these jeans but we're gonna go ahead and move on to another pair. 
Alrighty, so the next pair of jeans that we're going to be styling up quickly became a favorite of mine as soon as I tried them on. I looked for this style of jean for years and just could never find a pair that worked for my body or that was in my price range until I came across these. And that is gonna be my frame denim sailor jeans. I love these jeans, you guys. I paid like 170 for them, but honestly, they were worth it to me because they fit so well. The only thing that I don't like about these is that they don't have side pockets. They have back pockets but with all the cute details that I get and the way they fit it's worth it not to have pockets I don't even miss the pockets so these are like a really nice long pair of wide leg jeans they're very fitted at the top they are so cute and we're gonna be styling them up two different ways so let's get into the looks Alrighty folks, here is my first look dressing up my framed sailor jeans and I love this look. It definitely gives me summer vibes, it gives me nautical vibes, it gives me like Martha's Vineyard vibes, like just walking at a farmer's market or something. Definitely feeling this outfit. I threw on the jeans with this striped knit crop top. It, I, it is long enough for me to kind of tuck it in, but this is from H&M. It is a recent purchase, but I think it might've sold out, but I will link some similar options. And I threw in some red accessories to kind of make the outfit pop a little more. So I threw in these Chinese laundry platform sandals, if you guys can see those. Nice little simple red bag and some red flower earrings. So if you're interested in this look, I will certainly have it linked. I found some very similar jeans for you guys that are a lot more affordable. So yeah, really, really cute outfit. Girl, you can't tell me that it is. I am just feeling this all the way. But we're gonna go ahead and move on to another look, styling up these sailor jeans. Okay, here is my next look featuring the sailor jeans. And this one is a little bit more like, I would say churchy. <laughs> In my opinion, this is like an ideal look for like a Bible study or, you know, a casual church event where you guys aren't dressing up or anything like that. Or if you have like a business meeting after work, you can switch out your trousers, your work trousers for like some jeans like this and still look very professional, but you know, just kind of a little contrast there. So I love this look. I have on this shirt that has like a little pussy bow it is attached to the shirt this is from h and i've had it for about two years now but i will link some similar options and of course i have on the sailor jeans threw on some black heels from amazon to drop and a simple black bag and like i said very structured look very conservative very covered up so this is great for like anything relating to business or church i would say this is a really cute look so definitely a different contrast from the last look you saw so yeah those are two looks featuring my gorgeous sailor jeans and uh yeah we're gonna go ahead and move on because i could stay in these jeans all day they are so comfortable but we're gonna move on Alrighty, so this next pair of jeans is a recent addition to my jean collection. They cost me a pretty penny, y'all, but like I said, jeans are something that I'm willing to invest in when I find a pair that fits me really good. And these are gonna be the J. Crew trouser jean. I love these jeans. They are the absolute perfect pair of jeans. Like if you're looking for a perfect jean, this is it. And they also come in regular petite and tall, which is awesome. They run like up to plus sizes, so I love that. J. Crew really did it with these jeans. And this is like the ideal pair of jeans to wear to work. So if you work in like an environment where you have casual Fridays or you can wear jeans every day, this is like the perfect work jean. It's such a classic fit. It has like a nice tapered bottom, like really wide leg on the bottom, but nice and fitted on the top. And they just look good with like sweaters, turtlenecks and things like that. Really, really great pair of jeans. So we're gonna be styling those up two different ways. Those are the mid wash version. Let's go ahead and get into the looks. So here's the first look featuring the J. Crew wide leg trouser jeans. And do you guys see what I mean when I said these are like the perfect work jeans? Like if you are able to wear jeans to work, you gotta get these jeans. They're worth the investment and you can just wear them over and over and over and over and get all the cost for wear in the world out of these. But I dress them up by styling them with this gorgeous boucle gold and white cardigan. This cardigan is so elegant and when you add something like this to your jeans, it's definitely going to elevate it in such a nice way. I threw in some gold accessories, cute little gold bag from Shein and my gold Amazon to drop heels. You're gonna see those over and over. But yeah, I, I just love this look. It's so elegant. Totally could see myself wearing this to brunch or an early lunch, a nice little breakfast or something like that where I wanna look cute and dressed up and jazzy. Throw in some nice earrings, nice jewelry. I have on my gold Invicta watch. 
like things like that those little details are just gonna continue to elevate the look and girl I just love it I love the way these jeans fit and I love the way they feel like these are worth the investment honestly and yeah first look in these let's go ahead and give you guys one more look featuring these J. Crew jeans here is look number two featuring my J. Crew wide leg trousers and this is another look that I'm loving I don't know if this is ideal for summer and honestly I don't really care because like I said I dress the same all year long I promise you guys I do um but yeah this look is just it's so elegant these jeans are just so easy to style like that's one thing off the bat with these they're easy to style you can throw them on with anything a simple t-shirt some nice flats sneakers throw in a cute bag throw on your biggest blackest sunglasses and you look so chic like that's what i love about these really cute jeans so they're worth the investment to me but yeah i styled them with this puffy sleeve t-shirt style top this is from h&m i've had it for a few years threw in a black belt from target and i threw in my kate splay striped flats and a nice little straw and um leather bag like that i got from amazon it's not real leather but i thought it would be so cute because the shoes are made of like a straw material like a natural material Throw in some chunky jewelry, nice big sunglasses, and baby, we're ready for the streets. Like, we're ready for whatever. We look elegant, we look fun, we look like we got a little change in the bank. You feel me? This is the vibe. <laughs> I love this look. So, yeah, super easy to recreate. You can find these style of tops everywhere, especially on like Shein, Amazon. Just type in puffy sleeve black top. You can find a million of them. Style them with your nicest, cleanest jeans. And you've got the look honey super easy and very very nice but we're gonna go ahead and move on oh, i love those j crew jeans they are so so cute but now we're gonna get into another pair these are also j crew jeans these are the same exact jeans you just saw but they're in a dark wash and i don't know about you guys but when i think of jeans I style my lighter wash jeans different than I style the dark wash ones. Like, I don't know what it is, but I tend to kind of do dark wash jeans a little bit different than I do my lighter wash jeans. So I wanted to style some dark wash jeans for you all in case anybody out there has some that you're looking for some ideas on. So these again are the J. Crew wide leg trouser jean. The perfect jean for work, outside of work, whatever. Dress them up, dress them down. Today, we're going to jazz them up. So let's get into two looks featuring these dark wash wide leg trouser jeans. Now we are styling up the dark wash version of my J. Crew wide leg trousers. And honey, if this look isn't like shining and popping and giving 70s vibes all around, I'll explain it to you guys what I'm wearing. I'm wearing a really cute gold swimsuit. This is from Fashion Nova. I shared this with you all in a haul that I did maybe a month or two back. And I paired it with this River Island shirt that has like really nice large gold buttons on it just to kind of make it a little bit more of a like vacation-y type of look and a little bit more conservative. I also threw on this wide gold chain belt that's from Express and some gold accessories. So I have on gold platforms. Those are by Chinese Laundry, I believe. And then I threw in a cute little gold vintage little mini coin purse. So yeah, that is the look, y'all. I love it. I really wanted to like do something special with these jeans because I wanted to show you guys that you definitely can wear them for summer. And you can always take off this white shirt and just wear the swimsuit as is. Still looks cute, still looks sexy, still is a vibe that way. But I like to be a little bit more conservative. So yeah, this is the look. Very, very cute. I am loving it. All the little pops of shine on the feet and the belt and the swimsuit and the bag. Very, very nice. Let's go ahead and do one more look styling up these wide leg trousers. Uh, you guys, oh my goodness. This look is so me. Like this look is so me. Like it has every element of my style in it and I just love it. It's a red and white striped shirt, casual, fun, cute, very structured, very nice jeans, cute little red heel, nice red bag, gold accessories. Red and white headband to add a little bit of quirkiness. This look is so me, like, <laughs> I love it. I thought pairing these style of jeans and this color of jean would be great to do with a pattern top. You can go with polka dots, stripes, plaids, florals, anything would work. You can recreate a very similar look using a different pattern of shirt. Throw on some similar heels that match the color of the shirt. 
nice little bag in the mix. You don't have to do heels if you don't want to. Dressing up outfits and dressing up your jeans does not mean wearing heels. You can do a nice little pair of red flats like these from Shein if you want to. These will work just as good, but I wanted to do my little Amazon drops because y'all know how much I love them. They're so comfortable. And yeah, this is certainly a look that I have worn. I haven't worn these jeans yet, but I've worn this look with my denim skirt that's almost the same color as these. So pretty much the same look, but with a long denim skirt. Ugh y'all okay she's feeling herself in this red and white with the denim okay it's popping my belt is kenneth cole if i didn't mention that i've had this belt for like a couple of years but it's such a good leather belt like i wish i could find it and link it because it's genuine leather and it's such a good belt but yeah this look takes the cake y'all second look featuring my dark wash j crew wide leg trousers so we gonna move on because baby I think I'm feeling this a little bit too much. <laughs> Okay, so those are some really cute looks featuring a classic trouser jean and hopefully they helped you all out. If you have some, hopefully those ideas are something you can recreate in order to dress them up a little bit. But now we're going to get into some jeans that I would say are not for work, okay? These are the opposite of work jeans, okay? You do not want to wear these to work. You wanna wear these when you are going to slay with the girls, okay? <laughs> these are going to be destroyed jeans and these are made by Joe's Jeans. I got these at the thrift store and I actually distressed them myself. So I did all of this distressing. They didn't have any. I cut the bottoms to make them raw hem. They're a nice long pair of jeans. They're very fitted, they're very cute, and I'm gonna be styling them up two different ways. So if you have some destroyed jeans, you're gonna like these looks. Let's get into them. Alrighty, here is the first look featuring my destroyed Joe's jeans. And like I said, I'm a California girl and one thing that I've always loved is a little distressing or a destroyed look to my jeans. So yeah, these are definitely a vibe. May not be for everybody, but I love them. Let me know in the comments if you like destroyed jeans. I'm not talking about jeans with a little rip. I'm talking about, you feel me? <laughs> but I started with this sequin t-shirt style top. This is from H&M. I've had it for a few years. I will link some similar options for you all. This is one of the easiest ways to dress up a pair of jeans like this throw on a sequin top. I also threw on these really gorgeous metallic heels. Those are from, I think the Bloomingdale's outlet and they are by the Bloomingdale's brand. And I just threw in a little metallic pink bag to kind of go with all the pops of pink. So yeah, super cute outfit. Like I said, love these jeans. And if you don't have a pair of distressed or destroyed jeans, you can always take a pair that you're getting ready to throw out, give away, get rid of and do this to them. So just kind of slice them up as much as you want. I didn't do the back of mine. I basically stuck to the front. I think I might have done the pockets. Yeah, I did do the pockets, but um, I mostly just did the distressing on the front so that they'd be easier to put on. I just kind of turn them around, slide them up my leg and then turn it back. So yeah, really cute. Great going out look, brunch look, girls day out, girls night out, date night. This look can take you anywhere, so. That's another reason I love it. Let's go ahead and move on to one more look featuring these jeans. This next look is really cute and this is a really great way to dress up distressed or heavily destroyed jeans. Throw them on with a cute little girly top like this one. This one is from Pretty Little Thing. Of course, you know my jeans are Joe's jeans that I self-distressed. I have on some tan heels. Those are by Stradivarius from the ASOS website. I've had those for a while, but I will link some similar shoes and a similar top. I threw in my Teddy Blake bag with the look and a tan belt from Target. And this look is just so cute. This is like a summer vibe right here for me, especially because I don't like showing my arms all the time. And it just allows me to show a tiny little bit of midriff, like which is more my speed. And it's just very comfortable overall. The, strip, the jeans have a nice stretch to them, so they feel good to be in. So yeah, this is definitely like the perfect daytime date. Me and my boyfriend are going to a festival or some kind of, you know, some kind of street festival. This would be really cute to rock. And I could even do like my hair down or a wig, <laughs> y'all know me, and put on a cute little hat with this as well. But I just threw in some nice little brown sunglasses. And yeah, this look is a vibe, like accessorize it, you know, throw in some cute little accessories and you're ready to go. Cute look, right? Great for anything. I mean, I could definitely wear this to a cute little sexy girls night. 
you know, going to have some drinks or something like that. Or if I'm going clubbing, God forbid that should ever happen. If it does happen, I'm the one with the seated section. Gotta be me over in the corner with the seats. But yeah, this is real cute. I love this look. So easy to recreate. Cute little girly top, something off the shoulder, something that shows a little bit of midriff. Nice heels, cute bag. And you got the look, girlfriend. Okay, I love those looks featuring the destroyed jeans. As a certified California black girl, I can honestly tell you that we love a good destroyed jean out here. I know some places, you know, destroyed jeans is like, ugh, like they look cheap, they look awful, but out here, we love a good distressed destroyed jean. You'll see that a lot on the streets of LA. So yeah, I love those looks. And if you have some destroyed jeans, or if you wanna create some like I did, hopefully you can recreate those looks. And if you guys would like to see like a little video or a clip of something of me doing some distressed jeans. I can definitely go pick up a cheap pair from the thrift store and do that for you guys. Just let me know in the comments and I can kind of fit that into a vlog or something like that. So yeah, love those destroyed jeans. Now we're gonna get into what's kind of like a trendy jean. This style of jean has been trending for a couple of years and it's the asymmetrical closure jean. So as you can see, the closure of these jeans is at an angle. So the zipper is at an angle. It has two buttons, one here and one here. And they just look really cool. These are like a straight leg style of the jean in a light wash these are from asos a recent purchase and yeah i love those jeans we're gonna style them up two different ways so if you have some asymmetrical closure jeans you're gonna love these looks let's get into them here's the first look styling up my asymmetrical closure jeans like i said these are from the collusion line from asos and i love these jeans they're trendy yes of course they are trendy but they're also classic like they're very simple they're definitely something i can wear for years to come and i got mine in a size that's pretty comfortable so they're not like too too tight it gives me more versatility as far as styling goes and so with this look i styled it up with this metallic one shoulder bodysuit this is from fashion nova it's just a really simple little cute single shoulder bodysuit just tucks into the jeans really nicely and I threw on these pink metallic Amazon the drop heels and threw in a pink metallic bag so this is definitely a shiny fun look this is great for like going out you know got your little sassy bun going on a little spiked up hair this is definitely a vibe right here and I really really like this look so this is one way that you can wear your asymmetrical closure jeans Tuck in a nice bodysuit into them, add some nice popping accessories, and you have a definite look, honey, that is a whole vibe. So yeah, really cute look. Try it out if you have these types of jeans. Let's go ahead and do one more look featuring these jeans. Alrighty, here is the last look featuring my asymmetrical closure jeans, as well as the last look in the video, and baby, we're going out with a bang here, okay? If that last outfit did not dress up these jeans, this one is definitely doing the job. And what I basically did is throw on a sequin top. Instant upgrade, instant flashiness, instant dressiness. If you wanna do that for your jeans, add a sequin top. Make sure to pick up a few. ASOS has amazing ones. This one is from ASOS. I've had it for about a year. It's a cute little puffy sleeve, kind of crop top. Perfect for these very high-waisted jeans and it allows that asymmetrical closure to actually show as well. So really cute. The top is orange, so I threw on my orange metallic Amazon the Drop heels and threw in a really cute orange bag. So yeah, definitely coordinating right here with the jeans. And I love this look. This is definitely one of my faves in the video, you guys. This is the perfect going out look, brunch look, pretty much anything where you wanna be dressy and flashy, this is the look. So all you need is a sequin off the shoulder style of top high-waisted jeans you can do these style of jeans or any high-waisted jeans you have some cute heels and a cute bag and baby you rocking okay <laughs> i love this look like i feel cute in this so yeah last look it's bomb ain't it thank you all so much for checking out this video all about how to dress up your jeans i really hope you enjoyed it i hope you got some great ideas on how you can jazz up your jean looks when you are stepping out we haven't been getting ideal summer weather lately we've been getting a lot of rain a lot of overcast days so i'm still heavy in my jeans i don't know if that's the case for you guys i'd love to know in the comments what your weather is like right now because we are just not getting the heat that we usually get for like the last 30 40 years so i don't know what's going on but um i'm enjoying and wearing my jeans right now i'm still loving this weather because i'm not a summer lover so yeah if you're a jean girl like me year-round jean wearer 
this is the video for you. So I hope you enjoyed it and got some great ideas. Of course, I've linked all of my jeans as well as all of the tops that I shared in today's video. If the items are old, no longer available or low in stock, I have linked similar items. So if you want to recreate any of my looks, just check that description. I have everything linked there. But thank you all again for watching. If you're not subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button before you go. I promise you will not regret it. To all my regulars, I hope you enjoyed the video. I love you guys and I'll see you on the next one. Bye y'all.